My country people are greeting now once again, and I'm as I have again the diplomats eating you with the latest with that before Bodo Nigeria. Be making a like, share, and subscribe to this channel for more info. Here, the matter with the table now is Tinibu accepts Joe Biden's invitation to discuss at UN General Assembly. Tinibu accepts Joe Biden's invitation to discuss at UN General Assembly. Okay, you could fire down, you could fire down, go smart with the odds. Okay, you see, President Tinibu tasked U.S. Special Envoy on deepening cooperation and defense of democracy in West Africa as U.S. President Joe Biden extends an invitation for discussion at United Nations General Assembly. The president noted that American-backed development finance and multilateral institutions, which were designed to support war-torn Europe after World War II, require swift and comprehensive reform to meet the developmental requirements of younger democracies in Africa, which operate in authoritarian, crowded environments, such that the legitimate yearnings of Africans will no longer be manipulated to serve the narrow aims of self-seeking demagogue through unconstitutional takeover of power. Yes, the private sector will lead the way within an enabling environment we create for them, but the U.S. government must be innovative in its thinking and systematically create incentives for U.S. for U.S. for U.S. industrial investment in Nigeria. Under my leadership, Nigeria stands ready to address their specific regulatory tax, specific regulatory task and environmental concern. I am determined to create prosperity for all Nigerian families, the president declared. The Nigerian leader affirmed that the crisis in the Niger Republic would not deter him from concluding his economic reform program successfully for the benefit of Nigerians and that he takes a cue from, he takes a cue from, the, from no nation, but will only advance the interests of Nigerian state in his approach towards ECOWAS handling of the regional standoff. We are deep in our attempt to peacefully settle the issue in Niger by leveraging on our demo diplomatic tools. I continue to hold ECOWAS back despite its readiness for all options. In order to exhaust all other remedial mechanisms, war is not ideal for my economic reforms, nor for the region, but the defense of democracy is sacrosanct. Pledging support for the position of ECOWAS, the U.S. Special Presidential Envoy expressed the high regard the U.S. administration has for the leadership of the chairman of the ECOWAS Authority of Heads of State and Government, President Bola Ametinibu, and extended an exclusive invitation from U.S. President Joe Biden to meet on the sideline of the United Nations General Assembly in New York City to advance discussion further in late September. We know there is more we can do to incentivize large-scale American investment in Nigeria, and we committed to working close with you to achieve that. Uh, my people, now, see that now, President Joe Biden, Joe Biden, and the American president, and the guy don't invite uh, our president Bola Tinibu. Say for UN, say he say for UN, for UN meeting where they will go oh, for September, for September this year. He say he won't meet him and Tinibu sit down, man or man made a discourse. Tinibu himself, Tinibu said oh, accept the invitation and understand so tinibu call for the later tinibu call it call right the yana say you want me america and do more maybe do more for inside the africa you understand especially those africa when you say that democracy just the start newly the democracy never to mature well say you want me america do more say after the world war say america play second world war america play a very large scale in developing the whole of of europe the whole of the whole of west the whole of the europe the whole the western part you understand Yes, so you see, see they have they have a lot of investment. See America, see they get a lot of investment for inside the Nigeria. So see, so America still need to do more to make sure see that the democracy of these young countries they stand. My brother, now the reason this matter, I the reason I now just see this 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 matter. So you go get it. That's not the reason I hear. And you make the CRS they go, we could just observe them they go. You understand? I get so many comments. Where the first one say President will Sabi. The love we have for Tinibu be like, say, Buhari O, La Pleo. God, we thank you for not giving us, okay? It's not this guy, man. Huh? More fella, they go. I see why you, I dedicate, I see why you, I dedicate City Boys by Bob. This guy, the talk of boys, okay? Father, that guy say, God bless Nigeria. God bless His Excellency in Bola Amen Tinibu. Jagaba, everybody, just the praise Tinibu, the praise Tinibu. Honestly speaking, I don't know who said the praise and for sure. We don't know who the father and they go, okay? This guy more for here because Tinibu seems to want to exploit Niger's situation to the maximum. That is a smart move. 
Uh, why this guy mad at us? He said, "No, say Tini will just the front Nijay matter now." He said, "In good measure, say this Nijay matter enough. He hold up all the things we plan for Nigeria." My people ask now, see this matter. Ask now, see this invitation. Can go to the comment section. Leave one or two comments. You understand? Come, nigga, we let us 